This is the review of Wiley Fox Storm. In this small orange box, in addition to your Wiley Fox Storm smartphone, you will find warranty booklet, an instruction brochure, a key to SIM card tray, and a cool looking flat micro USB cable. Wiley Fox Storm makes a very good first impression, and its build quality is also high. The phone looks elegant and attractive. On the front, we have a large 5.5 inch Full HD IPS LCD display that has a resolution of 1920 by 1080 and has 400 pixels per inch. Below the screen you will find three capacity buttons, so you have access to the entire display. However, if you prefer on-screen buttons, you can turn them on in the phone settings. Above the screen there is an LED flash, earpiece and 8 megapixel front camera. On the top we find only a 3.5mm jack and on the right edge there is a volume rocker and power button. These buttons have a nice click. On the bottom edge we have a micro USB port and a microphone. On the left edge there is a SIM tray in which you can insert two nano SIM cards or a nano SIM card and a micro SD. It is not possible to use a dual SIM and memory card at the same time. On the back we find 20 megapixel camera from Sony. LED flash, microphone, Wiley Fox logo, brand name below, and a speaker. Similarly to Wiley Fox Swift, there is an orange border around the camera and LED flash, which looks nice and gives a nice contrast with the rest of the black cover. The back panel is made of plastic and has a nice to touch sandstone texture. The panel is slightly curved, which makes it more comfortable to hold it in hand. Due to the size of Wiley Fox Storm and the rear panel which is a little slippery, for the first few days when we have tried to use it on one hand, we were afraid that soon it will land on the floor. Unfortunately, the phone has non-removable battery with a capacity of 2500 mAh, which has the same capacity as the smaller model Wiley Fox Swift. The phone is 155mm long, 77 mm wide and the thickness is 9 mm. The weight is 155 grams. Wiley Fox Storm has 64-bit Snapdragon 615 octa-core processor clocked at 1.5 GHz, Adreno 405 GPU, 3 GB of RAM and 32 GB of internal memory which can be extended by an additional 128 GB by using memory card. The phone also has GPS with support for GLONASS and Bluetooth 4.0. Wiley Fox Storm is running CyanogenGen 12.1, which is based on Android 5.1.1 Lollipop. It is characterized by the fact that you will not find here a lot of unnecessary bloatware applications. However, you will find some interesting features such as Press and hold the main screen to display a pop-up menu, in which you can change the settings related to the appearance of the home screen and app drawer. Shop with free and premium themes. You can freely change elements of the user interface in each theme example by selecting components like wallpapers, icons, animations, fonts from different themes to make one that suits you the best. Audio FX application lets you change the profile of audio settings to match it with currently played music. You can also adjust the amount of bass or choose how you listen to the music through built-in speaker or headphones. Wiley Fox Storm has the same app drawer like Wiley Fox Swift. It is clear, works quickly and smoothly, and when you need to jump quickly to a desired application, you can use the alphabetic index at the bottom of the screen. In display and light settings, you can change settings of LED that is located below the screen. Depending on your notification settings, it will light up in a different color. Also, the navigation bar has some interesting features. Fast, double tap on the notification bar turns off the screen. If you pull it down, keeping a finger on the left or in the middle, notification from the applications will be displayed. Sliding the bar on the right side displays the drawer with shortcuts to settings for backlight, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, lamp or light display. Light display works like flux optimizes the backlight of the screen, 
based on the time of day and ambient conditions to improve readability and reduce eye strain. As previously mentioned, the phone has a large 5.5-inch display, which is pretty good. It displays crisp and warm images and has nice colors. Also, viewing angles are wide, so watching, for example, movies is comfortable. Only the color white is not as clean as we would like it to be. This does not affect the comfort when reading messages or playing games. The backlight of the screen is also good and using the smartphone in a direct sunlight is not a problem. Wiley Fox Storm works without problems, which is most likely thanks to 3 gigs of RAM. The phone works quickly and smoothly most of the time. Whether it's playing graphically demanding games or browsing websites with lots of pictures or while watching HD movies. Unfortunately, the same cannot be said about the battery. It has a capacity of 2500mAh, which is the same as smaller Wiley Fox Swift. It will allow you to do without charging during the day if you don't use it too extensively. Additionally, if you will use two SIM cards, this time will be shortened. Wiley Fox Storm has a 20 megapixel camera. Taking pictures is relatively fast and camera focus is fast too. With good light, the photos are nice and detailed. However, they are sometimes a little too saturated. Also, contrasting light levels can sometimes cause some problems. We have also noticed that when you set picture size to wide, camera slightly cuts off the top and bottom of the photo, which is not nice. After taking time to take the perfect photo, you find out it's missing some detail because of the trim. It is also possible that this occurs only to the reviewed BIOS unit. Camera app is equipped with a few basic functions and you can also select a night mode, action mode or HDR. Video can be recorded in 1080p and it can also do slow motion in 720p at 60fps. You can change the video and audio codecs that will be used during video recording. The camera app also supports changing the focus during the video recording. To sum up, Wiley Fox Storm is another interesting smartphone from Wiley Fox. At an attractive price, we get a smartphone that may not be perfect, but it is very efficient when it comes to specification. It looks elegant and works flawlessly in daily use. Thank you for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe.